Hi, welcome to Beginner Home Workout 2. So if you like some of my videos and you enjoy it, remember to like and subscribe it. Okay, so back to the topic. Today we're going to do beginner's home workout. So it's suitable for the uh, beginners or if you have some injury on your knees or lower back, it's definitely suitable for you. So no jumping. And all you need is just your mat and you can do it with or without shoes. Or you can do it even outdoor, just like me. All right, enjoy. Okay, let's go straight into the warm-up part. So now you can separate your feet, shoulder width apart. Okay, interlock your fingers and take a deep breath in, stretch it all the way up. And relax, Whew. drop it off. Yes, good, and again. All the way up, stretch your body super long, and let it go. Whew. Yeah, that's it, good stretch, two more. Whew. Excellent. Wow, it's good to take a deep breath outdoor, right? It's really refreshing. And relax. Okay, now we start to do some marching on the sports. No jumping, just simply stepping. And remember to move your whole body, your arms, including your legs, okay? And remember to lifting your knee forward. Yes, good, good. I know it's a bit weird to running on a sport, but try to coordinate your arms and legs, okay? Left arm, right leg, yes, good, good. Try to do a bit faster and get your heart rate up, okay? That's the whole point for the warm-up, right? Okay, and four, three, two, side stepping. Go to your right and left, side stepping jack, okay? Step jack, step jack, yes, good. And remember to bring your arms up and down, up and down, yes, good. And tap outside, so we work on different plane of movement. So we ju just did a, a sagittal movement and now we do the frontal movement. Yes, good. And four, three, two, okay, twisting side to side. To your right and left and right and left. Yes, good. Bring your elbows up. Excellent. Four, three, bring your knees up. Right knee up. Right knee. Left knee. Right. Left. Go. Go. Yes, get amazing. If you can, turn your head and shoulder at the same time. Look sideways. Four, three, two, one. Okay, now you can swing your arms forward. Yes, get, get, get. You can bounce with your legs to get some rhythm, to get some groove. Yeah. Four, three, two. Okay, backward. Go. And open your chest. Open your chest. Yes, get. And four, three, to you. Okay, now we can go for the side bending. Okay, so bend your body to your right and then back to the center to your left. And see if you can go with your head and your upper body. Okay, sink down a little bit lower, lower, lower. Yeah, feel a good stretch at your oblique at the side. Okay, to the right again and this time with your left arm up. Yes, good. Wow, the sun is really bright up here. To close my eyes. <laughs> Okay, good. And switch. One more for each side. Yes, good. Okay, let's do it again. One arm up. And this time, I need you to drop to the front and round your back. And get up to the opposite side, okay? And it's the same. Drop to the front and rise up to the opposite side. Yes, good. Have a good, stre have a good stretching on your back as well. Okay, two more. And last one. Okay, good. And now we can do the chest and upper back. So hugging a bit, big tree. Roll your chest in. Yeah, like that. And then open it up, arm to the back, as far as you can go. Okay, breathe out chest in. And open, yes, good. Breathe out and breathe in. Yes, good, do four fast, okay? Four. Three, two, one. Okay, good. And now I need you to do a half squat and stand up. Okay, so we're not doing the full squat. It's kind of uh, less tension on your knee. Okay, so hip to the back and move your knees out. Okay, your feet is like super stable on the floor. Okay, arms forward to balance it off. And breathe out, stand up. And lower your body down and stand up. It's fully in control, okay? Try not to drop your body, okay? Control it down, feel the muscle at your legs and glutes 
and get off. Okay, show you inside view. Get to the back, imagine you're sitting down on a chair, okay, with your hips. Nice, easy. And down and up and down and up and four, three, two, one. Okay, back to the half squat position, right? Keep your legs together, arm is still forward to balance it off. Okay, now we can step legs to the back and alternating. Okay, left leg, return, right leg, return. So you're kind of getting into a step back lunge position. Step, yes, get, go, go. Yeah, because we have some workouts, uh, some lunge, uh, split squat workouts, so we'll have to warm it up, warm it up your leg first. Four, three, two, one. Okay, good. Your legs now is nice and warm, right? Okay, let's do some active stretching for your legs, okay? So what you need to do is bring your left knee up and right arm is kind of a running pose, okay? And then kick back to your butt. All right, let's go. Knees up, kick back. Knees up, kick back, yes. Go, go, go. We're doing on one leg for us, okay? Ooh, super windy today. Okay. Four, three, ready, straight leg kick. Straight leg kick, back. Straight, back, yes. Front and back, yes. Okay. And four, three, two, one okay excellent so it's kind of a dynamic stretching for your leg right and then the stability on and on the standing leg okay good other side right leg knees up and kick back all right ready and let's go knees up kick back knees up kick back yes good i know it's difficult to coordinate the arms right now but you can just focus on your legs okay yes good up back four three ready straight legs straight legs yes good wow the city is really empty i can hear my own echo oh my god <laughs> straight legs kick back front back four three two one okay good now we can go back to the mat all right get on your belly hands next to your chest and then slowly roll your upper body up, you like upward facing the opposition, okay? So take your breath out, exhale, drop your hip low. Okay, another exhale, bring your chin up. Yeah, sink your belly bit. Okay, all right, now you can shift your hip to the back. Chapels, lengthen your spine, imagine your lace cap doing your stretching. Okay, good. Okay, roll that forward, high plank position, and go into a downward facing dog. Stretching the back of your leg. Look at the mat, long neck, hands pressing to the floor. And do the stepping with your heels. Step your heels into the floor. Yes, four, three, two, one. Okay, you can roll your body forward and walk your feet towards your hands. And then roll your body up. Excellent, let's go straight into the workout. All right, let's start the beginner workout part one. We have three exercises and we do it three rounds, okay? So the first one, we go into a split squat, okay? So what you need to do is bring your right leg at the front, left leg at the back, okay? And hands on your hip. And make sure when you go into this lunge position, don't stand on one line, okay? Super unstable. We can do it later, but for the first, for the first round, we do it easy, okay? So remember to separate your legs a little bit, okay? And actually, so this is the starting position, and actually there's a trick how to get up like super stable. So when you get up, imagine your feet is like stretching the mat back and forth, okay? Then you can fully engage your leg muscles. All right, let's try it out. So get into your starting position on your mat, okay? And make sure your hip is not like very lazy and shift it to the back, okay? Extend your hip joints, engage your glutes, hands on your hip, eyes forward, stand forward. Okay, break out, get up, break in, down, and don't drop, control it down and up. Okay, slowly up, and slowly down. Okay, one more slow. Okay, let's go faster. Let's go up, and down, and up, and down. And when you get up, I need you to fully extend your legs. Okay, don't go 
walk halfway and go down. Yeah. Okay, it's there anyway. Yeah, get eyes for The rental house strong is doing. Yes, yeah, I don't care anymore. Just get the work out done. Yes, get exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Four, three, two, one. Okay, it's perfect. Okay, turn to the other side. Left look at front, go into a second position on the ground. Okay, check the distance between two legs. Okay, ready? Let's go slowly up. Yeah, get the feeling first. Slowly down. Yeah, good. And try not to lean your body back, okay? Stay straight. Okay, one more slow. Yeah, good. Ready? Let's go. Up and down. Break out. Break in. Up. Down. And always keep your back heels up. Yeah, that's good. You try to focus all the power at your front leg. Excellent. And four. And three. And two. And one. Okay, good. So now we can go for the neutral stance, okay? And now we work with the arms. What you need to do is bring your arm forward, long, palm facing down, okay? And open your arm. Stretching something from the top of the table and under the table. We'll do it with the straight arm. Let's go. Open down. Open. Yes. Good. Palms up. Palms down. Palms up. Palms down. Yes. Good. Remember, swing your arms all the way back. Yes. I need you to stretch your chest and then train your shoulder at the same time. Go. Go. And stabilize your lower body, okay? Strong leg. Don't move. Super, super. Go. Go. Excellent, excellent. Keep your arms straight. Nice. Four. Three. Two. Okay. Exercise three. Whew. All right. We can go into your push-up. If you have a kitchen counter or a table next to you, you can definitely do it on the table, okay? Or with the straight leg. You have no, no option like me. You can do it on the mat. Okay, if you do it on the mat, you can do it on the knee. Okay, keep your feet up. And make sure you're opening all your fingers, okay? So it is like super stable for the push-up. And before we start, there's a lot of our, uh, uh, problem I saw before. So a lot of people shrinking your shoulder. Make sure you check your shoulder, set it down. Okay, long neck, look at the floor, really feel it out, yeah? Okay, now descending yourself all the way down to the floor. Chest on the floor, of course, you do the full and chest motion. And your hips stay down, okay? Squeeze your glutes. When you get up, breathe out. Yeah, easy like that, right? Okay, we do one more slow. All the way down. And breathe out, up. Okay, so we do two down and two up. Squeeze your butt. Ready? And let's go. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. What else can you get? Okay, like a machine. Yeah. If you do it on the table, it's the same. Okay, chest to your table and push it up. Yes, yes, yes. Four, three, keep your elbows down. Two, one. Okay, sit back and the bit. All right, now we can go into round two. Start from the beginning, go for the lunges, okay? Or split squat. Okay, good. Right leg at the front, left leg at the back. Go into a slanty position. And this time I want you to challenge yourself. I need you to put your hands behind your head, okay? And open your chest. Yeah, but still, eyes forward. Go straight. Okay, ready? Let's go. Stand up, and down, and up, and down. And control your body down. Try not to crush your knee to the floor. It's kind of painful, right? <laughs> yeah, it's good. Up, down. Now we get up, squeeze your back glutes, okay? Yes, we're perfect. Four, three, two, one. Okay, good. Now we can switch to the other side. Go down, check the posture, open the elbows, squeezing upper back, hip forward, 
Okay, stretching the mat to get off. And let's go. Up, down, up, down. Exhale, inhale. Break out, break in. Go. Yeah, good, good. And keep going, keep going. This is all I want to do. <laughs> Okay, good, good, good. Okay, back to the arms. How are you still remember what to do, right? So, palms down, palms up, okay? And this time, if you feel good, you can follow me. We'll bring one leg up, okay? Bring your left knee up. And try to balance it on one leg. And we do an arm thing. And let's go. Close, open, close, open. Yes, good, good. And also focus on your standing leg, okay? Squeezing good the how to get your core tension. Go, 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 go. Yes, good, good, love it. Four, four, three, three, two, two. Keep your arm moving and switch to the other side. Yes, good, good. Ooh. Wow, it's my very first outdoor workout. Actually, it's really good. Love it. Go, 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 go. Four, four, three, three, two, two, one, and one. Okay. Time for the push up. <clears throat> okay, go for it. All right, in the first round, we do two down and two up, right? And now, how about we do something super slow, okay? So on the way down, we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and when we get to the eight, we do an explosive push up, okay? And make sure you're not bring your elbows out, keep it low. Close to your body. Okay. Okay, let's do a super slow control push up. Okay, three to four. Ready? Okay, get into your get up position first. And let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Push, two, two, four. Yeah, that's it. Slow and control. Sometimes when you do the movement slowly, it's more painful. Yes, good. One, two, three, four, five, Push, come on. Three more to go. Keep your neck long. Let me look at the floor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Push. Ooh, wow, that's gonna really nice. Okay, good. Last round for the first part. Okay, back into the lunge position. All right, there's two options for you. You can do the normal uh, split squat up and down we're doing, or you can do the inline lunge with me. Yes, it, as, as I said before in the first round, it's super unstable, but when you put it in the workout, it's also a very good challenging workout. Too. Bring your balance, okay? And core tension. Okay. So you can go separate your legs or keep your keep your legs in one line, okay? Hands behind your head. Remember, when you get up, stretch the mat. Okay, and let's go. Up and down and up and down. And get put up with the speed. Exhale, inhale. When you break out harder, you can fully engage your abs. That helps you to stabilize your whole body. Yes. Yeah. Four, three, two, and last one to go. Yeah, that's it. All right. Got it. So go for separate your legs or in line. Okay, head up, open elbows, and let's go. Up. Wow, this is also challenging for me, but all you need to do is stay focused. Find something in front of you to look at. And keep your alignment long, okay? Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, amazing. Okay, good. And then the arm thing, right? And this time we're also doing single leg, but we keep switching, okay? So close, open, close open yeah up and down and let's go 
Imagine there's a table in front of you, and you move your hands above the table and under the table. Yes, good, good. Remember to open your chest, yeah? Don't do a little movement like that, okay? Yes, good. Excellent. Four, three, two, one. Okay. Okay, last one. It's a little bit out of favor, so okay. Okay, good. Push up. Okay, this time we don't do the slow one, we do the quick. So, one down, one up. Max it out, okay? Okay, start with the up position. Okay, ready? Squeeze your butt, drop your hip low, and also hug in your tummy. And let's go. Down, up, down, up, down, up. Yes, good, good, good. Work like a robot, work like a machine. If you can, bring your chest down. All the way to the mat. Yes, come on, five, four. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Nice. Yeah, well done. That's it for part one. Okay, part two. In part two, we do three exercises on the mat. Okay, so easy peasy, no more like work. Okay, good. So the first one, we're going to do a side plank. Hip lifts. Okay, so what you can do is go into a side plank position, okay? And you can do it on the knee, alright? So check your elbows, hip, and knee down at the same line, okay? And the top hand on your hip. And what you need to do is break out and squeeze your butt and lifting your hip up. That's it, okay? And, and check your elbows, it's right below your shoulder. And open up your fingers for the bottom hands. Ready? Let's go. Up, down. Up, down, yes, good, excellent. And try not to go back with your hip, okay? When you get up, open your hip joints, okay? Extend your hip forward. Excellent. Up, down, up, down, four, three, two, one. Okay, so you're definitely feeling the side of your hip. Okay, let's switch the other side. Okay, good. Check everything in one line. Okay, chest up, chin up, hands on your hip, and ready. Let's go. Up, down, up, down. Good, good, good. Try to squeeze your hip up a little bit higher. Yes, good. Super, super. Up, down. And make sure at the same time you're not lifting your shoulder too high, okay? Stay strong and solid with the shoulder. And then get up, your elbows press down. Four, three, two, one. Okay, right? And now we go into a paper position. Let good exercise, we're going to do the bird dog, okay? But first of all, I need you to find a neutral spine position. You can do some head and cow and find the middle point of it, okay? And set your skin pillow down. Okay, and your back foot, you can press down into the mat, okay? So when you're pressing it down, you feel more tension at your stomach, right? Okay, let's start with the right arm, left leg. Okay, so first you bring them up at the same time, extend, and the front arm comes off. So you do an external rotation of the upper arm. Okay, back to the mat. Easy, right? Okay, good, so ready? Let's go. Up, two, three, four. Yes, get the same pacing. When you're going up and going down. Good. And your bottom hand keeps pushing into the mat. Yes, good, good. So you can feel more, more tension when you're doing that. Okay, three more. And two. And one. Okay, good. And then switch the other side. Left and right leg. And Always tucking your belly, yeah? No matter what. Actually, you're tucking in your belly for the full workout. Up. And when you move your arms up, your upper arm is kind of next to your ear. Yes, excellent. Super. And lengthen your legs super long at the back. Okay, give me three more. Inhale, open. Exhale, turn. Last two. 
that's one. Okay, good. Well done, excellent. Okay, good. Now we can get down on your belly. You have a little rest. Come up to you. Yeah, perfect. So what you need to do is, I need, I need you to do a C and W sit down. So it's like an interstitial B and W, right? Okay. So we do it with the arms. So facing down, long arm forward, and down. Okay. B. And then drive the elbows back to the W. Okay. So inhale B and W. Yes. Yeah. And you should check your forearms. Your arms should be parallel to the ground. If you're doing something like that, it's not good, yeah? The long arm, drive it to the back. Sit, forward, back, forward, back. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. And you drive it to the back, you should feel your scapular and your lats. Feel your upper back muscle. Four, three, Okay, good. Round two. Easy peasy. It's quite fast, right? Yeah, okay. Good. Check your alignment. Good. 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 And actually, you can use the top arm to help you. When you go up, your finger is like reaching up to the sky. Yes, yeah, good. So you can keep your arms super straight. Four, three, two, one. Okay, nice. Okay, other side. I really like this experience, like feeling the video all day. It's really refreshing, especially now that there's not so many people all day, right? Okay, good. Get yourself set up ready. Arms up. And ready to go. Up, down, up, down. Yeah, remember, check your fingers. Pushing up to the sky. Yes. Up, down, up, down. Good, good. Four. Four, three, two, one. Up, 
actually with that skill. Super. So let's go straight into the last round. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, last one. Something more interesting, yeah? Okay, you can do what we did before. You can put your hands here or there. Or you can follow me, all right? So when we go up, we lift the arms and lift up. So it's like a drama queen position, okay? And then drop your hip down. Okay, ready? And let's go. Up and down and up and down. Hands up. Point toes. Come on, come on. Try your best. This is the last round. Yes. Get and squeeze on your hip. Bring it up. And four as well, yeah? Four. Three. Two. One. All right. Wow. Okay, this one is really good on the hip. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, elbows, hip, knee on the same line. Okay, hands on hip, open, or you do it with me. Swing it up with your legs. Okay, ready? Let's go. Keep up, keep down. Keep up, keep down. Up, down. Yes, good, good, excellent. Come on. Go. When using power, exhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Four, three, two, Okay. Oh, my God. That's not really good. Okay. So this time we're going to do the bird dog and with a little bit coordination, okay? So what we need to do is right arm, left leg, return and then switch to the other side immediately. Alternating. Keep switching. Ready? And let's go. Out, in, switch. Out, in, switch. So you have to make sure you get the balance point once you land, okay? Out, in, out, in. Yes, good. And also pay attention to your details. Your foot is pressing down, okay? Your shoulder is down. Your neck is super long. Yes, good. Super, super. Out, in, out, in. Excellent. Come on, come on, keep going. Out, in, four. Okay. So in the last round for the Superman, you can stay up with your leg, or if you want to challenge yourself, you can kick your legs with me. Why are you doing your arms? Okay, marching task. Ready? Let's go. Roll it down. Four. Down. Four. Exhale. Inhale. Come on, last one, last one. Exhale. Inhale. Let's go. Down. Okay, that's the first day. Alright, you have a few minutes left, you can do a quick stretch in Because in the first part, we did a lot for the upper legs, right? So stretch it out, and then lazy position of yoga. So, get the head down on your hands, and then use your right hand to grab it up from the back. And press your foot down into your body. So, you can back it and then you're doing a stretch here on the quad, the front of the upper leg. Okay, let go. Left hand, left leg. Okay, step go. And make sure you step the cushion into the floor, yeah? Good, good, good. And then, let's go to the left. Up, down, down, down. Okay, let's go. If you don't feel comfortable, you can just slightly bend your elbows. I think you don't need to fully extend it. The most important. Get the hip down, okay? Throw the shoulder back. Breathe it out, chin up. <laughs> Alright, now we go straight into the ground. Okay, and keep your hip up. Pull it down into the floor. Hand to the back. Hand to the back. Alright, roll your body forward and walk your feet as true as you can. Okay, that's it for the beginner homework out too. So I hope you enjoy it. So see you in the next workout video.